Hi, my name is Bridget Vaughn. I am a psychiatric nurse practitioner. I work for the University of Nebraska Medical Center. My clinical practice is at the Monroe Meyer Institute in the Department of Developmental and Behavioral Pediatrics. I also work at UNMC's Department of Psychiatry. I work there as a nurse practitioner and as a research coordinator. Psychiatric mental health nurses are registered nurses who practice as specialists in psychiatric and mental health care. We work primarily with children, adolescents, adults, and families with mental health issues. Uh, we provide inpatient and outpatient care and also provide services in a range of facilities, including schools, correctional facilities, and other treatment centers. Advanced practice psychiatric mental health nurses or nurse practitioners are psychiatric nurses who have went on for additional education and training so that we can practice autonomously and provide diagnosis as well as treatment, including medication management for our clients. Our clients include children, adolescents, adults, geriatric patients, and families. The first step is that you want to be a nurse. Nursing education is quite general. You go to nursing school either in a two-year program or sometimes a four-year program, depending if you're looking to earn a diploma or associate's degree or a four-year college degree. And there are nurses in mental health who practice with an LPN, though I think more and more nurses are going toward the baccalaureate and registered nurse level. Once your general nursing education is done, you'll take your state boards and become licensed as a registered nurse. Some of us will want to pursue advanced practice education and move on to be a more autonomous provider. This involves application to a master's level nursing program. A requirement of a master's degree program is completion of your BSN and commitment to an another two to three years of study. Some advanced practice nurses also look at the Doctor of Nursing Practice Program, or the DNP, which is an additional three, year, three to four years of study. After completion of the master's program or the DNP program, you'll be required to take an additional licensing exam in order to practice as a psychiatric mental health nurse practitioner. The first skill is to have empathy. We need to be able to meet our patients where they are, accept where they are, and then help them in the process of changing. You need to be a good listener and a good communicator. It never hurts to have a very good memory. Our patients are not snapshots, they are stories, and we need to understand their history, recall it, and be able to help them work with it to move forward. Communication skills, Verbally and in writing are important. Our reports are used by schools and other agencies in order to get services for our clients. So it's very important to be a good writer and to be able to communicate our thoughts in a way that is going to be most beneficial to our patients. The first time I thought about being a psychiatric nurse was prior to my clinical rotation in psychiatric nursing at Creighton University. I had completed a long-term care rotation at the Mercy Care Center. And I remember thinking of the clients that I took care of there, which included the very first AIDS patient I ever took care of, as well as a gentleman with MS who had to divorce his spouse in order to continue to get funding for his treatment there. And I remember thinking, that these people were so much more than the illness that they were dealing with. And I enjoyed so much more the time that I spent talking to them about what they thought of the situation they were in, what it was doing to their families, and how it was affecting their life. These things affected whether or not they wanted to comply with their physical treatments and how they looked at their physical care. If you can't tell, I am extremely attached to the patients and families that I work with, and I love that the most. I like being part of where they were and where they're going. I like to feel very independent in what I'm doing. I also enjoy working as a nurse because that changes the way patients talk to you. 
I love my physician clients, but patients talk to nurses differently, and I think we bring special value to mental health care when we keep that in mind. I would encourage you to see that mental health care is as important as physical health care, that it can't be separated from it, and that it's something that you will find across the lifespan. You will always be a real nurse, and you will always need to know those things. But you will also become an extremely valuable part of someone's life, and you'll never know when you're going to change it.